what the hell is this world coming to? Y'all might have heard by now. And the story is kind of fresh, just not popping up. Somebody apparently drove a truck straight through the barricade at the FBI, F, FBI building. Just... It's still kind of fresh right now. It's only like a couple hours old. It just happened. And what they saying on the news, I'm going to read some of this article right here and I'm going to leave this in the description box too. But uh, I don't know if it says it in this article, but the other article that I was reading and the news, a couple of news clippings that I saw, it was like they tried to follow an authorized vehicle just straight through the front gate. Like, you know, like you authorize, you go through and they just try to run through right up behind. Like, so what they say, they're going to, uh, they sent them to, uh, sent them or him, her, whoever, to a psychiatric hospital to see if they kind of crazy. You got to be some kind of crazy. Just, I mean, you're lucky you didn't get skipped you know, have your life skip to the next lifetime let me read some of this FBI says a driver rammed a vehicle into the front gate of its Atlanta field office FBI says a driver rammed a vehicle into the front gate at its Atlanta field office on Monday but his motives were not immediately known. So it is a dude. The crash happened shortly after noon. Pete Ellis, assistant special agent in charge of the agency's Atlanta office, told reporters the man tried to follow another vehicle through the gate and onto the FBI campus in suburban Chambly. I guess that's how you say it, Chambly. But security cautions prevented him from entering several from entering several agents who were passing by took the man into custody and no one was injured Ellis said the man who was not associated with the FBI facility was taken to an Atlanta hospital for evaluation okay that's the part I remember the other, the other newscast said you gotta be some kind of crazy cuckoo Law enforcement officials are looking into both state and federal charges, but they are. Agents and bomb technicians check the vehicle as a precaution as part of the agency's standard operating procedures, Ellis said. Video from the scene showed a reddish orange SUV with its hood crumpled against the retractable. I found this on the web. Quiet. Siri, we ain't talking to you. Retractable barrier just inside the front gate. The vehicle was taken away by tow truck just before 4 p.m. So like right around rush hour, I guess. I mean, did he put in an application? And, you know, you mad they didn't get back to him? Like, you just drive up in here, you know. Get up in here by any means necessary. Uh, I think they threw my application out. I think they deleted it. I'm uh, make them retrieve it because I'm crazy that's what I envision I'm thinking doing that I mean that's the only thing that makes sense right y'all let me know what y'all think I think that dude is cuckoo, cuckoo. Later.